There are two positive cases of coronavirus in New Hampshire right now. One of them is an employee of Dartmouth Hitchcock Medical Center. He had traveled to Italy and was told by the state to self-isolate, but he didn't do that and ended up passing the virus on to someone else. It's definitely on students' minds um, and partly because the, the college has been very open in communicating. Now, a Tuck Business School student who potentially came in contact with the first person who tested positive and has reported flu-like symptoms is in isolation. Also, four Geisel School of Medicine students who came in contact with the second positive case are also being isolated. The business school canceled classes for today and final exams will be done online. All international travel has also been canceled for this month. That's an area of concern um, just because things are changing every day. So what's going to happen two, two weeks from now. Um, will students be uh, allowed back in the country? Meantime, a response team has been activated in Lebanon, which covers 12 towns in the Upper Valley. It's just a meeting to just, for lack of a better term, get ahead of the game. And that's what we're trying to do here. The group will respond and help coordinate information about a potential outbreak if that should happen. We ran 7 to 7 today. We'll probably back that off to maybe an 8 to 5 and then adjust it accordingly and we'll have somebody here on the weekend. The chief says if this does escalate, their operations will become 24-7. We're live in Hanover tonight. Kristen Carosa, WMUR News 9.